Here's another video. This video will be going correlation with the last video. This is going to be talking about the legal bottom people who can stay in your house legally or illegally. Alright, this is not going to start that. Remember, I'm not a lawyer, and this is what I know. Go by the terms of state. If you say I'm not, if you say I'm wrong, that never happened, then you live under a rock. I don't even watch TV. I stopped watching TV at the age of five, and yet I know this. I may not know the basic stuff of like who this next hot clothes in mind, but I don't care about clothing. So, anyway. Take this, uh, there was a situation on the news where a person allowed a homely person to stay in their house. So we used to watch the news people voluntarily. That person stayed in that house for three months receiving mail, have this stuff there and all this stuff. That person did not put money into that house, did not do maintenance to that house, did not help with that house. Did no financial need that would keep that house in place. That person of that house tried to kick that person out. And this is not black people, people. That was white people. But this has happened to every color because I didn't believe me. Different things does happen with different colors. You don't do that to like certain people. A group of people or anybody in real, especially those people. Anyway. When this person tried to kick that person out the house, that group of people out the house, that person in that house sued that person, the owner of that house, and then the police came. Coincidentally, I don't know why that police was black. They tried to try to be, oh, police is bad, especially that one. But you guys are smart enough to use these stuff. It's the other kind of way, but you know. Anyway, all kinds of rainbow. Uh, anyway, you guys need to know you can keep a homeless person in the house for three months where they receive an and stay in your house regardless of what they're doing and you can kick them out. Can you know why? According to everything else, especially certain states, they are legally staying in the house. They have legal rights to that house. That's right, people. I say this because I know. I've seen it. They have legal rights to your house. They don't put money in. They're both over the age of 20. They don't work. They don't do nothing. They eat your food, run your electricity, make your water bill high. They don't put nothing into it, and yet for somehow they legally stay down. Can't. That is the law that you guys need to fix. In my turn, that is the same law as. Housing someone that's unwanted, but yet somehow that's different from that situation. Come on. Like housing soldiers, military, unwanted. That is the same that law. So when you allow someone to stay in your house, you need to make sure they're not staying there for a long time or every day or make sure that not much of their mail is going to, or if it does and they say it, you need to call that up and get that fixed. Not that much to do. Or you should be prepared of the consequences when you do want to kick them out. If I remember correctly, if you don't give a written notice to the city that does with that, a tenant or the rent or housing that does that stuff, that you legally kicked this person, told this person to get out. If you did that, then they have to get out within the time frame. Of minimum 45 days or 30 days, if I remember clearly. I don't know for sure. You have to look it up based on the state, different stuff. If you told me that, that is the legal process of kicking that situation out your house. That is unnecessary. That is really um, unnecessary. Nobody, for me wise, is going to stay in my house and not pay bill not pay water not do anything beneficial to the house as a whole they like parasites lifting off of me they're not doing anything period and then the audacity to complain to you about better stuff and want more from you that should be a law and all that you can DDT them and make them out your house that's right I said if it's you, your kids, your babies, your children, you are getting out of their house because, you know, that group. But that won't really 
happen to me. There's that 0.01% chance that will, but you know, that won't happen because no body is staying in my house unless they are that third crap of group of people that are always in, and we are really cool with that. We'll have less chance of happening. Anyway, that's that situation. Know the rights of your house and who you allow to come in there. If there are, if you go out of the laws like sex offenders, now, now actually, this is only for that group, sex offenders. If according to something that everybody agrees on, sex offenders are based on their record history and blah blah blah, they are not allowed to stay at a certain distance from schools. Or anything that we're just playing children, period. Period. And yet people are still there and that nobody doing anything about it. When I say nobody, the legal is not doing anything about it. And that's like basic underlying law. Um, it's You guys should really look up your sex offenders. It's a free public list. It's funny. There are only two kinds of sex offenders that... I'm worried about this three and all. There's only two kinds. Those who don't care, stay away from me. Those who are trick. That guy said he was 16 and you are 22 year old woman and you slept with that 16 year old. Really? Come on. Or if you a guy in that Females, male and their female says she's 21 and you're like 30 and she's actually 13. That is that kind of group. That's that second kind of group. Now, I don't really concern myself about you, especially once you've been proven, once you prove it to me and it's actually true. And I don't know why you don't prove it to the court, but if you did prove it to the court, I don't know why everybody else is concerned about it. But you are not the people who are smart enough to. Be educated to be around me, so that's right. I associate you with you, but we would not get along. We always associate you, but we are not being. Then there are those third group of people. These people are deformed, have like no brain cells at all. They are literally on the borderline just being a, an animal, or right? not know that better, or literally. Not even considered something that could be on a level as like a, of equal humans. These are the people that are, how shall I say, have a mental disaffect. Not a mental disaffect, but they were raised into that mental disaffect. And it's unfair. And these are people who are born with that disaffect. Cryotypes, Alzheimer's, freaking... So many people, we never going to say people who lack the chromosomes to make their brain, the body operate what everybody else is agreeing on. These are the people that I have no problem with at all. I, if they are around me, I'm prepared to handle the situation if it gets out of the hand. There is no hate. There is no anger. There is no dislike. There is not that much you can do about that situation other than you either hang around that person or you don't hang around that person. And back in the term of laws, allowing people in that area, you got to fix that. Um, there are times where you have people who somehow are sex offenders, but they are never had sex before. And they're on a sex offender list, and there have been no crimes that go back to everything. It's when someone tried to screw you over. You need to fix that. Base, uh, this, it's not that difficult, people. I'm not a certified lawyer, but if you want it, you can always go to the Department of Justice, get a book of their laws, ask for the script of it, blah, 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 pull everything up. Pull everything up and read it yourself and then go for more sources and more sources to you are satisfied to you get the understanding of what is the law and what is not the law and then 
go apply for it. But this, we're not going to get any more specific about this because those are other classes of law, like white collar law, racketeering, or forgery. There's a whole bunch of other laws. Hell, I'm out. Video about the law. Only other videos will be about the game. See y'all.